Welcome to Poker Market, making poker more efficient. Happy holidays, guys. This is Paul, aka Internet, trying to win a million dollars in a five dollar spin and go. Let's go. Ten dollars. What the hell, man? I wanted to play for a million. Ah, oh, we're still gonna try to play as well as possible, even though it's just a ten dollar buy in. Both people fold on the first hand. This is gonna be a tough table to play at. Um, at 25 big blinds, I'll be playing a small blind limp strategy with a lot of hands. So this is pretty standard limp here. Pre-flop, flops, just a you know protection bet, thin value bet. Turns definitely a check call. Don't think it makes too much sense to bet. And river will be a bit tough. Nine, not good at all for us. He's gonna have a ten only bets at once for a min bet on the turn. That's really good. So he's not particularly good. I guess I don't have to label people in a five dollar spin and go, but I'm very used to doing that. So we'll just do that. Uh, no reason to steal a button with the queen three offset here at all. Um, I expect the opponents to be very, very loose, very, very push happy pre flops. So we're not gonna do any stealing with uh, subpar hands. Get a button limp and a complete. Very nice for nine two off. Uh, despite the gut shot, I don't think there's any. Uh, anyway, this is a plus EV bet on the flop, or you know that betting is better than checking. Uh, this is a pretty tough spot for. 16% uh, pot odds here, drawing to week one card straight. I think it's a fold, but I wouldn't be surprised if it actually is a call, because we can definitely win the pot if we hit the nine, like on this turn card. Um, and we do have implied odds with the seven against these guys, right? They're gonna be, you know, doing some weird stuff. So I'm not 100% sure that that's a fold, but okay. Um, we did that. Six eight. We're probably gonna be able to play. Get another limp here, so this is pretty nice for us. Uh, flop nothing, no reason to start bluffing. I think it's a good turn spot to start bluffing in general against these guys though. You know, it's very easy to have absolutely nothing on this board. There's there's so many hands with a complete error. I will take a stab on the river for sure. I will get called by a 4 and a 5 certainly, but I think there's enough total error which they're just going to fold, which actually happens. So yeah, that's nice. King 7, I do think it's good enough to raise, although I wouldn't call a shove. And if you're playing against guys that are going to be shoving extremely often, may actually just not be an open or just a direct shove yourself, I suppose, although that's pretty loose. Um, I actually don't know what to do here, but I think that's a fold, right? Because we're, yeah, I don't I don't think he's leading complete air, so it's, there's no way we're ever in good shape. We're always in, like, really, really, really bad shape. This is definitely a value raise. I don't want to shove that red.